nine, five, six, five, five. Uh, the reason I stopped you, I mean, obviously, y'all, you speed speeding, almost caused an accident back there. Why, why are you going so fast? Right. How about you had to drink tonight? Just one or two? All right, here, why don't you step out and come back with me real quick? You say you work for, you say you work with the Cavaliers? Okay. okay. All right, so, again, the reason I stopped you, obviously, what we just talked about, um, you say you had one or two tonight? One or two? All right, so we'll put you through a few field sobriety tests, all right? All right, why don't you try to follow the tip of my hand, but don't move your head. Just follow with your eyes, your eyes only, okay? You ready? Mm -hmm. no, don't move your head, just your eyes. It's called the walk and turn test, all right? When I tell you to do so, I'm going to have you uh, take nine heel to toe steps straight forward. When you get to your ninth step, you're going to leave your front foot forward, and you can take nine heel to toe steps straight back, okay? While you're doing this test, you're going to count out loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, so it's also two. Oh, got back from overseas trip. Okay. I promise you I'm the president of the Cavaliers. I, I just got back from overseas trip as well, so I'm also exhausted. Okay. Just had a long dinner. I mean, I'm trying to understand the, understand the test. Yeah. I'm just trying to work with you on, I was trying to get home. I, I mean, my I understand family. that, but I mean, the reason I stopped you because you almost caused an accident, right? Well, I don't think I, I mean, I, I get that. He was being slow, I tried to get in front of him to go to the left lane. I, I've driven multiple times, I know exactly what I was doing. I don't think I caused an accident. I didn't say you caused one. I said you almost caused okay. one, right? He was paying attention. He swerved and moved out of the way. You're going, you're flying, well, he, coming up no, behind no, but me. But he, he moved over, so I, I was going to take that lane. I understand. So how fast do you think you were going? I, I don't know, but I wasn't going over the speed limit. Okay. I, I just, ain't no sense of us even talking. I, 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 mean, I, I got you. I mean, we don't, we, we're in this, we're, you're talking about something that, I'm talking about what happened, you're talking about something that didn't happen. You're talking about you're not going over the speed limit, and you're flying up in the pass, in the, in the pass lane, the guy, then you try to cut over, and the guy sees you, he swerves and moves out of the way. I, I don't understand, I don't understand, but, okay. Again, walk and turn test, all right? Uh, straight like this. This one's called the one leg stand test. When I tell you to do so, I'm gonna have you raise one foot off the ground approximately six inches right out in front of you like this. You're gonna point it down slightly and you're gonna look down at it. And you're gonna count in this manner, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, okay? Just gonna keep going until I tell you to stop, okay? It's a 30 second time test. So whenever you're ready, you go ahead and begin and use either foot that you want, either, either leg you want to balance on. How long? It's a 30 second time test. It's a long time. It's 30 seconds. It's, if you happen to put your foot down, just pick it back up on the number that you left off, okay? Again. So it, I can do five seconds down, five seconds. No, well, the goal is not to put your foot down. I'm just telling you, if you do, just pick back up on the number that you left off. Again, okay. hands are down to your side, feet together. You're gonna, this? No. no, down to your side. You got to raise one foot. You know I'm in sports and it's hard to keep your balance. Well, you're in sports, it's supposed to be easier to keep your no, balance. No, 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 it's hard. Oh, I thought it should be easier. So wait a minute, so you're gonna raise it off. Don't forget, you're gonna be looking down at your foot, okay? So make sure you're looking at your foot during the entire set. Wait, 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 wait. Don't get to practice this either. No right? practice, no practice. <laughs> Whenever you're ready, go ahead and begin. We're doing... Look at your foot, sir. Look at your foot, down here. Yeah, you messed me up. Oh, you're supposed to be, I why gave you the instructions. That's not the test. Keep going where I can't hear you counting. Alright, All right. so you ever been arrested for OBI before? 
Have you ever been arrested for a VI before? No? This is a pre-arrest breath test, sir. Tell me about how much alcohol you have in your system, okay? Do I have to take that? No, you can refuse it. You refuse it? Okay. All right, sir. You're under arrest for OVI. You have the right to, right to remain silent and say you can't get against the court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice and for answering the questions have the presence of you doing questioning if you so desire. If you wish to answer questions now by lawyer present, you also have the right to stop and answer at any time. You also have the right to stop answering any time until you talk to a lawyer. If you can't afford a lawyer, you won't be appointed for your party in the questions if you so desire. You understand those rights, sir?